After becoming the center of the Dallas shopping experience and possibly wanting your kids to be part of an elite academic and athletic experience, you and your family are now considering a move to Allen, Texas. Before you do, watch this video so you know what to expect while living in Allen, Texas. My name is Mike Harrison, your local realtor here in North Texas. Let's go and dive into this incredible city. Allen has a population of approximately 109,000 and it's continuously been featured in the national rankings of safety, affordability, education, and quality of life. And if you've watched my previous videos, you know I like to highlight the national accolades many of these North Texas cities have, so here we go. Allen had the number two best real estate market in 2022, according to Wallet Hub. Its school district had an A-plus overall grade in 2020, according to Niche.com. It was ranked one of the 50 safest cities in Texas in 2020, the number two safest city in Texas in 2019, the number two best place to launch a career in 2018, it was ranked the best suburb in Texas in 2018, and the number two best place to live in America in 2017. It's the fourth largest area in Collin County, right behind Plano, Frisco, and McKinney, and it's bordered by McKinney on the north side, Plano on the south, Frisco on the west side, and Lucas on the east. Some other quick points on the demographics of Allen. Allen has a median age of 36, a median household income of 112,000, a median home value of 368,000, and 31,000 single family units. Allen is known for its high school football, beautiful homes, and great shopping experiences. When you consider the Allen Outlet Mall, the villages at Allen, and Waters Creek, I have Allen as the best overall city to shop in in all of DFW. Let's go ahead and dive further into the shopping experiences that Allen has to offer. Starting with the Allen Outlet Mall, this area used to be the main reason you would visit Allen in the early to mid 2000s, as it has many clothing retailers and it's been considered one of the premier outlet destinations in all of DFW. Located just off Highway 75 and Stacy Road, the outlets offer more than 120 designer and name brand outlet stores, including Tory Burch, Kate Spade, New York, Michael Kors, Coach, the Nike Factory Store, Ralph Lauren, Under Armour, and many more. It almost feels to me like Allen was built around this outlet mall as you've seen so much commercial development over the last 10 to 15 years right in this area. Heads up though, because of the outlet mall's popularity and the fact that it's built like a large square with the parking in the middle, the parking here is horrible and you'll oftentimes spend as much time waiting for a parking spot as you do actually shopping here, especially when it's time to do some school shopping or Christmas shopping. Next, you have the village at Allen. I remember when this was being built years ago, many of the locals would say that this was gonna be the next mall of America. The Village at Allen is a dynamic shopping, dining, and entertainment destination for Allen as it combines hospitality, retail, and entertainment options for you. It has over 1 million square feet of mixed-use development and features some of the area's most popular attractions like Cabela's, Topgolf, and the Allen Event Center that hosts more than 100 events per year. Believe it or not, I saw a little way perform here 15 years ago. Let me tell you, he had that place jumping. My go-to spot to eat here is at Freebirds. Every time my family and I are in the area, we have to stop at Freebirds as it tastes slightly different than Chipotle. Some other quick dining options are Raising Cane's, Pluckers, and the nationally famous In-N-Out Burger. And then of course you have your big retailers like Best Buy, Target, Dick's Sporting Goods, and I've personally spent way too much time and money at the Men's Warehouse store. There's just something about how you look better in suits while you're in the store than you do when you leave the store. Lastly, you have Waters Creek Village, this is a very charming area and it's probably my favorite place to shop in Allen. To me, whenever you're walking around the area, it almost feels like you're part of a quaint European village versus a big bustling city. This 52 acre project is located off 75 and Bethany Drive. It offers a complete mix of public art, retail options, restaurants, office space, and residential lofts. For dining, we have the Cheesecake Factory, Mikosina, Panera Bread, and P.F. Chang's as the bigger corporate option. And then you have many shopping options, including Chico's, Eddie Bayer, Pandora, Sephora, and many more. If you're looking for a date not in Allen, this is where I recommend spending your time. Our next lifestyle factor as you consider moving to Allen is gonna be the unique recreation and activities located here. There are 67 parks in Allen with nearly 1,400 acres of parkland and nearly 80 miles of hiking and biking trails. You also have the Hydras Wake Park. This is a five acre man-made lake that offers kneeboarding and wakeboarding lessons. It's basically a giant inflatable obstacle course on the water. We have Celebration Park, a local favorite by many, and this has a spray ground, basketball courts, baseball and softball fields, soccer fields, hiking and biking trails, barbecue grills, picnic tables, and a covered pavilion. We have the Don Rodenball Natatorium. This is a great place for year-round fun and fitness activity. This place offers a 25 yard by 25 meter competition pool with two one meter diving boards, three 25 yard fitness lanes, 
slides, a lazy river, a climbing wall, and a 5,000 square foot fitness facility. So while Dallas or Allen, Texas doesn't have any beaches or mountains, there are many lakes within DFW and Allen is located next to several of them. Within 10 to 30 minutes of Allen, you can be at Lake Louisville, Grapevine Lake, Lavon Lake, and Lake Ray Hubbard. Lake Lavon is right next door to Allen and Lucas. Lake Ray Hubbard is in Rockwall. Grapevine Lake borders several cities on the west side of Dallas and Louisville Lake is within a 30 minute drive as well. So if you're a nature enthusiast and enjoy trails, fishing or boating, you're still within a short drive while living in Allen. Now let's go ahead and quickly cover the location that Allen has within the DFW Metroplex. I've mentioned in my Plano, Texas videos how centralized it feels while being in Plano. It's the same with Allen. Allen is a city that is just north of Plano, so you're gonna have similar benefits while living there as well. You already have more shopping than probably any other city in DFW, but if you have other lifestyle factors like you're a frequent traveler, you're only about 30 to 35 minutes away from the local airport. You may already know this, but the DFW airport is very centrally located in America, so you're only about a three hour flight to almost anywhere in the States. You are 30 minutes from downtown Dallas, 30 minutes from the American Airlines Center for Dallas Mavericks and Dallas Stars games. You're also 45 minutes from Arlington that houses AT&T Stadium for Dallas Cowboys games, Globe Life Field for the Texas Ranger games, and both include some of the biggest concerts in DFW every year, as well as Six Flags and Hurricane Harbor Water Park. If you wanna have a Las Vegas type experience and try your hand at gambling, or just lounge by one of the best casino pools in all of America, you're only about an hour away from Choctaw Casino. And one of the best parts of living in Allen is experiencing the great academic and athletic programs that it has to offer. Allen is well known for its top rated schools, making an ideal place for families with children. The Allen Independent School District consistently receives high marks for its academic performance and extracurricular activity. It has become one of the top football programs in Texas over the last 15 years, winning five state championships and became only the fourth high school in state history to win the state championship three years in a row while being the first to do so in the state's largest classification. The program's popularity became so big that Allen built an 18,000 seat stadium, a project of nearly $60 million. It's the fifth largest high school stadium in the state, but the largest designed for the use of only one team. And cities like McKinney and Frisco have so many schools that they have to share stadium. Texas Monthly reported in 2021 that Allen has the largest UIL athletic program of any Texas high school, including archer, baseball, basketball, bowling, cheerleading, cross country, drill team, football, golf, hockey, lacrosse, band, rugby, soccer, softball, spikeball, swimming and diving teams, table tennis, tennis, track and field, volleyball, and wrestling. To further emphasize the athletic standards here, the girls golf program won state in 2005, 2006, and 2012. The wrestling team, boys and girls bowling team, hockey team, boys basketball team, and archery team have also all won Texas State Championship. Niche.com gave Allen ISD an a overall rating and ranked it as the number eight school district in Texas. On average, Allen students score 176 points higher on the SAT than the national average, and over 90% of the students go into higher education, and the elementary and middle schools have a higher proficiency in math and science than the national average. So whether you're looking at niche.com or greatschools.com, you're gonna see after doing your own research that Allen has high expectations and high standards for its academics there. So guys, this is gonna close us out on what it's like to live in Allen, Texas. If you made it to the end of this video, thank you so much for watching. I truly appreciate it. Do me a favor, go ahead and like the video and subscribe to the channel, please. If you ever have any questions about Allen or would like a tour of any of the homes here, please don't hesitate to contact me. All of my info is included in the top comment below. And lastly, if you wanna see what another great North Texas suburb is like, check out this video by clicking here.